She is in the studio, not Andra. <laughs> All right. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm great. I'm happy to be here. I am, yeah. <laughs> well, we hope that you will love your Atlanta stay. I know you used to live here for a little while. Yes, so. I did. I was. I was in Stone Mountain for a minute with what? my aunt. Yeah. You was mm-hmm. in a rock? Yeah. Let me find out. Okay, so you have had an amazing, I don't know, year? Yeah. <laughs> Last year was pretty incredible. There were some amazing things. It started off amazing with Sundance Film Festival and doing the tribute to Tina and Simone and being in the lineup with Erica Badu and, and singing Common. with Stevie so and singing with Stevie yeah. so we're going to talk about that but let's get into your Grammy nominated single mm-hmm. Rise Up yes on Rise Z103. Up 103 <laughs> you're broken down and tired of living life on the merry-go-round and you can't find a fighter but I see it in you so we gonna walk it out We gon' walk it out and move on days And I rise up, I rise like the day I rise up, I rise unafraid I rise up and I do it a thousand eight times again Silence is it quiet And it feels like it's getting hard to breathe And I know you feel like dying But I promise we would take the world to its feet Rise up, and of course, it's Andra Day. She is in the studio. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Watch v103.com. Watch v103.com. We got the cameras on, okay? So right. I got to tell you. Hey, where hey, you guys at? Right? Every, <laughs> everywhere. There's a camera. Oh my God, there's a camera. There's a camera. So, From every so, angle. Let me sit up straight, okay? Right. <laughs> it's, it's, it's okay, because you look beautiful. I saw the, the um, complex... Um, interview you did mm-hmm. without makeup yes yes and that was really awesome <laughs> oh thank you <laughs> very courageous and awesome yeah thank you i appreciate it i mean i i just think you know not that i have anything against makeup you know i like it and i wear it when i work most of the time if i'm not working though then i'm just you know barefaced but i just think it just shouldn't be crippling you know i shouldn't yeah. feel like i'm less than when i walk out the door and i don't have it on so you know yeah. well take me back of course this has been a monster year for you mm-hmm. uh take me back to when you got the news about the collaboration with Stevie Wonder. Oh, yeah. Like, really? <laughs> well, it's funny. It actually came through Apple. Apple has just been incredibly supportive the entire time. And so when the idea for the commercial came up, they were like, we thought of you and only <laughs> you. And I was like, oh, my God. They didn't find out till later that he was actually who discovered me in the first place before <gasps> I even started the album. Yeah. Stop playing. Yeah, they didn't even know. Yeah. So how funny. did you meet Stevie Wonder? So he actually, him and Kaimila were the ones who discovered me. They heard a clip of me singing. Someone took video of me singing in front of a little store in a strip mall in Malibu and and um, she played it for Stevie and he liked what he heard and so he orchestrated a call with the guy I was working with at the time and <gasps> and was like, hey, you know, talking about I want to write a song with you. I won't say the <gasps> name in case he still wants to do it. And then he talked about astrology as well. Did too, you believe it? You know what? It was extremely surreal. I knew the call was coming, so that's why I believed it. But it was just, it was still one of those experiences. I'm in a tiny apartment with my mother. You know, one bedroom apartment, four or 500 square feet maybe. And this huge presence just calls to be like, hey, let's write some songs together. I was just like, wow, it was amazing. You would think that the collaborations wouldn't end after this, but (laughs) this brings me to my next point. Forever Mine, Mm -hmm. here we are with Forever Mine, Mm -hmm. and then Spike Lee ends up directing your video yes <laughs> really that, that was also another incredible thing and directed it for no fee by the way what? he was just like you look at director's fee is a big fat zero by it and i just was so grateful to him like really an angel honestly and he saw me at sundance i performed at sundance a nina simone tribute and i did mississippi goddamn and i came off stage mm. and he was like so you working on an album i said yeah he's like well who's directing the first video and i was like uh <laughs> you? okay you know right. what let's get into forever mine <laughs>
Andrew Day. Cheers to the fall from this album, Forever Mine, V103, right? <laughs> yep. Making moves and losing out Play so many times before 